Y'all, this is the Lincoln home. It's one of the earliest homes in Columbus. It, too, is a raised cottage. Look at all those stairs. Can you imagine carrying your groceries up them stairs all the days? Anyways, his home was restored and by Ronnie and Pat Locke in the 70s. And this house was built in 1833. It's called the Lincoln Home. It's now owned by the owners of the Amzie Love Home, Sid Carradine and his wife. But this house, y'all, it's for sale. You can buy it. It's a gorgeous home. It's been used as a bread, bed and breakfast in the past. And now it is uh, apartments, I believe. There's long-term tenants that are in there. It's a very quiet little little community and it's surrounded by gorgeous old growth azaleas and the upkeep on it's been pretty good although I I would reckon I'd put a new roof on it but I've seen Sid out here working on those stairs and bits and pieces of wood because you know old houses take a lot of work a lot of work but this house could be yours for I don't know a little under four hundred thousand dollars but it's really a lovely house, and it's got a sweet garden out back, and a nice, I think it has a deck out there. One time it did. Let's take a little look and see if we see. Uh, I don't think there's a deck. Maybe I'm mistaken, but anyways, this could be an income property for you. You could live upstairs. It's right down the street from the women's college, so I bet you could get you some renters real good, or some of those people that like to live in a neighborhood and work elsewhere because this is a quiet little street well thanks for joining me on my little tour of my little town Columbus <gasps> and we can look down the street Mississippi have a great day